This story is called The Eye of Ra, and it's about a man who works in a restaurant who has apparently done prison time recently, and he's approached by a man who offers him an illegal job of stealing coin from a recent excavation of an Egyptian tomb. The coin is known as the Eye of Ra, which is the Egyptian god of the sun, and the hired thief realizes that this coin has some hypnotic powers over him, and he accepts the job because he feels the need to steal it. And when he goes to retrieve the coin later that night, the man who is currently in possession of the coin fills him in on some sketchy details that the coin gives the holder some serious psychological powers to read all of the minds of everyone in the world. But it's quickly realized that he doesn't want these powers because the thoughts of everyone in the world is maddening. But the coin has a hypnotic power and convinces the man to steal the coin anyway from this old shriveled up man who has no eyeballs because he's already clawed his own eyes out out of madness from what the thoughts of other people have driven him to do. So the old man with no eyes attacks the thief and the thief stabs him in the neck, takes the coin, and he can immediately start seeing the future as he predicts the make and model of the car that is coming towards him as he drives away in the night. Can you imagine being able to see everything that's ever happened in the world, being able to see everything that's going to happen in the world, and having this opportunity given to you to take into possession the coin that can give you this ability, this little coin from an Egyptian tomb, and all you gotta do is go steal it from the guy who dug it up. And on top of that, you're gonna get paid $10,000 to steal it. If you were given that opportunity, what, would you take it? What would you do? It's driven people mad because this guy clawed his own eyes out to stop seeing what he was seeing. And the guy who did end up stealing it, I mean, you know that he's gonna have a bad ending to his story. Would it be worth it though? Even to just say that you remember everything that's ever happened, everything that's ever going to happen, you could say that you know that stuff. You might be crazy. You might be reading the minds of seven billion people at the same time. You might be living the lives of billions of people who have lived, but you want to kill yourself. You you don't want it. Because it, it makes you crazy. And nobody would believe you about anything. It's not a plausible idea that anybody can know everything that's ever happened or everything that's ever going to happen. Unreal. But people will do crazy things for $10,000 for sure. I would not do it. Knowing the consequences, I would not do it. Not knowing the consequences in the end, maybe. $10,000 to go take a coin from an old blind man? Yeah, I'd probably do it. But as soon as I know what's going on, if I can avoid the hypnotic powers of the Eye of Ra coin, knowing the curse of the coin changes the story. So this story wasn't really creepy. It makes you think. makes you think if something like this were actually possible.